Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the new trading group. So I just want to go over with you guys guys um, trade after the EIA news. So the EIA news said we actually have a build in crude oil, but because of just gasoline, gasoline, because gasoline had a big um uh, uh reduction and demand is actually uh high. That's why it really pushed the um crude oil back up. I'm trying to find the news right here. Okay, so the news report says uh US oil stockpile rise after Hurricane Harvey. So US inventories of oil surge higher for the week ended September eighth as continued refinery outages due to Hurricane Harvey kept demand for crude oil low. According to data released Wednesday by the EIA, crude oil stockpiles jumped by 5.9 million barrels to 468.2 million barrels and remained the upper half of the average range for this time of the year. And the EIA said analyst surveys that the Wall Street Journal had predicted that crude oils would rise by 3.7. And oil store at Cushing, Oklahoma delivery rose by 1 million. Gasoline stockpiles fell by 8. 4 million barrels, and I believe that is one of the reasons why it pushed up in the market today. So with that said, um, the news is right here at 7.30. Didn't really have much action movement going on. And um, I was asleep until 8 a.m. this morning, so I kind of woke up into this. Uh, there was a trade to get in right here at this 93, but I woke up a little bit later than that, so I was just waiting for the next proper setup and letting it establish a new low in this upper region so that I have a area for my stop. So it made this high of 49.08, came back down, tagged this 85. So I drew a trend line up here and a trend line down here just in case to give me um give me a, a clear direction, a clear breakout. So there's a trade to get in right here at the 49.07. 49.07 and the stop was at 48.85. And the target was 49.31. Risk reward on this trade would be 15 plus 7 equals $220 of risk in order to make $240, I believe. So, you know, it's a, it's a good day, you know, not, not a significant day, not a huge great day. But, hey, you know, any winning day is a great day for me. Other than that, so we're up two times this week. And right now, it should make most likely um, head towards the $50 area or the 50 area. I'm not sure, but um, I'm done with my trade for the day. And you guys take care. I'll see you guys tomorrow at 5.50 a.m. You guys have a fantastic day and uh, stay disciplined. Okay, guys? Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.